Hey everybody, it's the coach. This is a special edition of the Divisional Round Playoffs on EA Sports. Straight ahead, we've got what should be an interesting matchup between the Indianapolis Colts and the Oakland Raiders. So the football will be at the 25-yard line as this offense gets set to take over. down Martin and he'll be upended at the 28 yard line just a three yard gain there well I think that's what they're going to need to do here in the first half you've got to take some pressure off of this young quarterback and no better way to do it than to establish the running game early. rolling to his right and that'll be incomplete we do have a penalty flag down however let's see what that's about so they saw the contact before the ball arrived. Penalty flag for pass interference. And trying to avoid pass interference is so difficult. You're trying to slow down these skilled receivers, and somehow, some way, they make plays on the football, and sometimes you're there too soon. Pass the 20, and they'll wind up getting this one all the way down inside the 20. Big gains in succession. Last one was over 20, this one over 30. So the big play means just like that, they'll operate from the red zone now on first down. They're going to look to throw. They'll buy some time right. This is caught. And out of bounds all the way down at the three. Back-to-back -back nice gains. That one for 14 yards and another first. And perhaps now close to the first points of this divisional round game. And he's in. Touchdown, Raiders. A three-yard touchdown run. As his guys are able to strike first here in this opening corner. So they take the opening kickoff and drive it all the way down the field. And that's the last thing you want defensively. So this offense will head back out there. Already an excellent field position thanks to the interception. Here's a play fake as they set up to throw. And it's caught. And he is in. Touchdown, Raiders. This offense ready to head back out there as they'll take over with a little over a minute to play in this first quarter. They'll run on first down. It's Martin. Martin flexing the muscle. And he gets this one just shy of the 40, down at the 39. 14 yards is the pick up there at a Raider first. Getting the sense Charles are going to put a big emphasis this afternoon on the run game. And why not? What we're seeing so far, working pretty well from them. And here's the best part. We always talk about the best performers do their job when the lights come on. I think he likes natural light best. Now here's a pass on first down that's knocked away and incomplete. That's on the big guard, Gabe Jackson. Flush to his right. He's going to take off with it. Turns out to be a great idea to tuck that one. Good for 24 yards. On that play, as you saw the route start to develop downfield, I got the sense that maybe the run would set up for him. And he took full advantage of it and got a big gain on a busted play. He's going to throw one up for the ends. That's going to be caught by Williams for a Raiders touchdown. So we are in the final minute now of the first half as this offense gets ready to take over. They'll try and start this drive in the air. Forced out to his left. He'll try and run it. Uh, he's got this almost to the 40 before going out. The coverage may be too good that time as he breaks away for 19 with his legs and a first down. From up near the 40 now after the big play to start, here's another first and 10. Now he's going to swing this one out to his running back. 
And he'll be taken down, but not before he works it past the 50. 14 yards is the pick up there at a Waiter first. Back-to-back -back good plays have him on the move on first down. They run the counter with Martin. And that'll hurt the average a bit as this time they're able to get him behind the line. Play three of the drive not as successful. They go backwards after those two first down gains. Second quarter action, two minutes to go on divisional round weekend. We remind you, as we've done all year, that coming up at halftime, we will visit with Jonathan Coachman standing by in Orlando. He'll let you know what's going on here on a very eventful divisional round weekend. Eluding the pressure right. He'll run it. And he'll go down, but not before getting this inside the 30. And they'll get him to the ground. He has another first down at the Colts 26. Partner, it's often the man coverage is easier for a quarterback to run against. You get your receivers going downfield. Those guys are staying with them, and oftentimes they have their back to the quarterback, which opens up a lot of space and room, and they don't even know that he's taken off with it. What a big-time pickup on that play. Second and 15, sliding out of the pocket. His throw caught right around the six. That'll be marked as a 27-yard pickup. As a general rule, offensive linemen like to know where their quarterback's going to be when he's setting up to throw the football. But sometimes they just have to get on the run, get on the move. He was able to do that on that play and picks up a first down with a nice throw. A chance to really cap off a big first half here as they come up on first and goal. They'll run. Martin. And he will push his way forward down to about the three-yard line. He'll get two out of that run, and it's going to bring up a second and goal. So the ball position now at the three. Here's second and goal. Shreds, and he fights his way into the end zone for a Raider touchdown. So the football will be at the 25-yard line as this offense gets set to take over. Now a play fake here on first down. Buying time to his left. He's going deep for Brooke. That's caught inside the 20. And he finally is out of bounds, but he's down inside the 20-yard line. Excellent execution, and now they're set up nicely. Are they ever? Red zone? After reviewing the play, the ruling on the field is reversed. The head coach relied on his eagle eye in the sky to make the right call and was told to challenge it, and it looks like it's paid off. And from a coach's standpoint, when you throw that flag, it's probably a pretty tense moment here at Paisal. Yeah, you have that little bit of indecision. You throw it where you feel like you're right, and then you think, uh-oh, did I get it right? In this case, they can celebrate. On first down, Martin. He's going to get this down to the 35-yard line. That good for 22 and a first down. Well, partner, I have to say they caught him in the right defense there. Nickel set, fifth defensive back on the field, and they love to run against that because now you typically get a bigger blocker on a smaller defender. And down he goes. They sack him back right around the 41-yard line. Got to assume this defense will be charging again here. It's second and 15. They'll look to throw here. Being chased out left. Got his man. It's Williams. 17 yards on the catch and run. It's a first down. One quarter remains for the right to advance to the AFC title game. This is the National Football League on EA Sports. First down. That's complete to his tight end. This is Lance Kendricks. 
And they are able to stop him, but he does take it all the way to the two. A good pickup there, 21 yards. Two big plays in succession. Not sure this D knows what hit him, but now they got to get ready. It's first and goal. Back to the ground, Martin. And just a short gain that time as they're able to get him down. Give him two yards on that one. Second and goal now. On the ground, this is Smith. And he is in. Touchdown, Raiders. Keith Smith taking it in. And the Raiders able to extend that advantage. So, my man, another touchdown. They're looking like the number one seed that they earned throughout the year. Looking pretty dominant right now. We knew the road to the Super Bowl. So now this offense will take over and they will have the football at their own 20-yard line. They start the drive with Martin. And he'll go down at the 26 following a gain of six. Just two minutes remaining here in the fourth quarter of what has been a one-sided affair. From the 26, they'll line up on second and four. Second and four steps away. And some strong running. He'll have a first down past the 40. And they are going to score again. Yet another touchdown as they just add to their totals. So the football will be at the 25-yard line as this offense gets set to take over. Now it looks like he'll throw here, escaping the pressure right. On the run, he'll let it go. Oh, this is taken in. It's complete. Yeah, he's going to be out of bounds, but not before he takes it inside the 40. And give him a gain of 37. Boy, another big play late here for an offense, Charles. It certainly has had its fair share of big plays. Coverage has been a problem all game long. And I would say that going along with that has been confidence. Because even if they had the right coverage... And this will be caught. And the carnage continues. It's another touchdown. So now we're in the final minute of the game in the fourth quarter as this offense gets ready to take over. On first down, he'll drop to throw. On the move to his left. Now he'll let it go on the run. Deep left side. And it's incomplete. He's still throwing to the very end. But now this game is over. And they have secured a spot in the conference championship. And now you can start to smell it at this point in the season, can't you? You really can because the focus has been one game at a time, not looking ahead. But when you get to the conference championship game and you know... Start your week by installing your game plan.
guys, we all watched the film from yesterday, and I hope everyone knows it wasn't good enough. Today's practice has got... Ready, set! Return! Here we go! Ten, touch again! Hard go! Hey, you know what, guys? That was pretty dang good. And you know what gets me really excited? You haven't even... Hello everybody, it's the coach. This is a special edition of the AFC Championship. So the football will be at the 25 yard line as this offense gets set to take over. They'll run on first down. Richard, and he's taken down, but able to slip across the 35. Give him 12 yards that time at an Oakland first down. Well, CD, a lot of times like to separate speed and quickness, and they've got a back that's both. We know that he's fast in the open field, but man, his first step is so quick, too. It is something, isn't it? Because you think of that type of speed getting to the perimeter and turning up field, but also when you run those inside runs, he can get into the secondary so fast, the linebackers don't have a chance to react. Two yards the game there, and now they're left with a third and about four for a first. Out of the gun now on third down. Dancing to his left. He may try and run for this. Yeah, he will go out right near the 35-yard line. 23 yards on the tuck and run. That's something you have to be aware of as a defense and have to find a way to account for him. And if you're not going to use a spy, you're telling your guys to keep your eyes on him because when he breaks out and makes plays like that, all he does is hurt you. Have to at least be able to contain him somewhat. There they could not. Flushed out right. And that's going to be knocked away and incomplete. And with it, time has expired on the first quarter. After one, seven nothing on EA Sports. Back to throw now on second and ten. And he's going to keep it here. He'll get the first down and more inside the 20. And he's going to get it all the way down to the 10 yard line. Turns out to be a great idea to tuck that one. Good for 24 yards. Watch the screen, watch the screen. On first down, Martin. And he'll be brought down right on the edge of the goal line at about the one yard line. 10 yards on the pickup there, and it'll be second down. On second down, it's Martin. And he's in. Touchdown, Hooray! With a little over 
two minutes to play in the second quarter. The offense gets ready to take over. Watch the curl. He'll come out throwing here on first down. Steps away to his left. And he's got his tight end. This is Luke Wilson. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. AFC title game, second quarter action. Two minutes to play. And a reminder, folks, as we've done all year, we'll send you to Orlando for our EA Sports halftime report coming up shortly. The coach with us, as always, as he will start to look ahead to Super Bowl 53. 20. And oh, so close as he takes it all the way to the two-yard line. Big yardage there on the scramble. It gets him a first down. So he wanted to pass it, but that thing turned out much better. And the crowd really responded, didn't they? And he's over the line and in for a later touchdown. Taking it in from two yards out as they are an extra point away now from tying this football game. Nice job of polishing off that drive at all the Right now we're all even. It's a tie game as we drop you back in and the offense gets set to take over. Back to throw here. They'll roll him out right. And that's going to be incomplete. Too tough to hold on to that one. It's second down. So after the incompletion on first, now second and ten. This is Richard. And a short gain here across the ten to the twelve. Now the Browns will use the first of their three timeouts as they'll stop it with just over 40 seconds to go in the first half. They'll look to throw, forced out to his left. He can run for it, and he will. And all the way down to the 40-yard line. Big yardage there on the scramble. It gets him a first down. Not only another first down, that also puts him over 100 yards rushing. That's not something you see very often in the NFL. We see it more in college. But I think with more of the melding of the college game with quarterbacks, we'll see this a little bit more often in the future. Now the Raiders going to go ahead and use the second of their timeouts as they'll stop it with 14 seconds to go in this first half. So the big play moves them all the way across midfield to the 40 now for first and 10. to throw. Buying time to his left. Towards the end zone for Brown. Incomplete. And we're down to eight seconds now. Antonio Brown, the intended receiver. But it'll be second down. So second down and ten. Once again, they'll go from the 40. Second and ten. Rolling to his right. He's going to take a shot at the... And that is caught. Touchdown, Raiders. Tyrell Williams. In the final seconds of the first half, as they have... This offense ready to get back out there as they'll have the football to start the third quarter. The third quarter starts with a run by Martin. And he's brought down, getting this one up to about the 35. A pickup of 10, and it's enough for an Oakland first down. That's pretty much mean potatoes right there, wasn't it? Just go right at them and let your big horse charge up the middle. Not too fancy there, was it? Nothing fancy at all, challenging that defense. And on that go around, the offense won the challenge. Here's a throw out wide complete to his running back right side. It'll be a gain of six, and it'll be a second down. And we see another pitch and catch there to the running back. This position just continues to evolve. They become just as critical to the passing attack as a lot of receivers' tight ends because their ability to make people miss in the open field can really generate big plays for an offense. And they're well past midfield, just a yard or two shy of the 40. The pickup goes for 16 and a Raider first down. They'll 
look to throw here on first down. Being chased out left. That's complete to Williams out of the backfield. What a play that turns out to be 36 yards. He had one touchdown earlier, nearly a second one there. Yeah, it took a touchdown saving tackle to keep him out of the end zone after a big play. Perhaps you go right back to him. Don't need the distance, but maybe he can pay things off after a big effort. And he's able to get it down to the two-yard line. A pickup of four on first down. It'll be second and goal. Well, Brandon, we always know that once you score one touchdown, you you're, two. <laughs> you're without a doubt. And so far today, he's got one, but was denied as he tried to get the second one. And this is caught. Touchdown, Raiders. Luke Wilson there to make. Both offenses have been clicking in this one. A lot of points on the board. We'll see if that trend continues. Here's Martin as they begin on the ground. And a nice gain there as he'll be taken down just shy of the 20. It's a seven-yard carry to set them up with a second and three. So they'll come up after the gain of seven on a second and three. They run it again with Martin. And he'll be taken down at the 20 after a gain of just one. And this is an absolutely big third down that's been set up here, partner. And there's no other way to put it. The defense has to get a stop here to have any hopes of winning this game. As to you said big third down, I'd put the word big in capital letters here. And he's taken down but able to slip across the 35. Here we go. Here we go. That is an absolute backbreaker. That was a design passing play, wasn't a draw. You think you got him stopped, good coverage downfield, and he's able to pick up the first with his legs. Defensively, that kicks into your psyche and hurts a little bit, doesn't it? It certainly does, and, and here's the thing. Anytime you give up a first down, it hurts you psychologically, but it hurts more when they get it this way because you've covered everything. He didn't have any place to throw the football. He takes off running and picks it up anyway, and now you have to stay on the field for an extra set of downs. And really could have used that stop trailing here in the fourth. Whistles now and a timeout. So defensively, they burn it here with 1.51 left. And not totally home free yet, but it's looking good as they come up first and 10. He'll drop to throw, dance into his left. Now he'll pull it down and brought down, but not before they're inside the 25. Now the Browns signal for the second of their timeouts. And they'll be disappointed to have to burn one there after giving up the first down. All runs on this drive so far. It's first and 10. Now Martin. So he got free of one tackle, but couldn't do a whole lot else. The Browns will quickly use their third and final timeout as they'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. Second and five. Rolling to his left. And now he's going to use his legs. And now they're inside the 10 as he's brought down at the nine. Eight yards that time. Able to take off, and the result is a first down. How many times have we seen this late in the fourth quarter? Because you know the pass rush is getting after him, and they get upfield, get that great push, and what do they create? Space, and he takes off. Now back to throw, and incomplete as he was knocked as he threw it, and it took the ball off course. When defenses get to the quarterback that quickly, a lot of times it's called a jailbreak. It wasn't quite that fast, but fast enough that he had no time to look downfield and set himself to throw the ball. And as he tried to do that... And he's across for the touchdown. And in the final minute, that should just about seal it. And the AFC champion has been crowned onto the Super Bowl. There cannot be a better feeling than this. It's almost indescribable. And when we talk to players from the past, a lot of them mention getting to the Super Bowl, winning a conference championship, even before they talk about the Super Bowl itself. All that hard work to get to your goal, incredible. And that does it for the conference championship. For Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon, and for our entire crew, we'll see you two weeks at the Super Bowl. This is the NFL on EA Sports.